Welcome and build a restaurant site with Python and Django. My name is Mahmoud and I'll be your instructor in this course. This course we will build a restaurant site using Python and Django. We will learn how can we treat with the virtual environments, install Django, install Django packages, how can we create a project, create an app, design a model, treating with views, forms, URLs, treating with templates, template filters, treating with admin panel and the admin panel customization and so on. Let's take a look at our project. First of all, this is our home page and this is our navbar. You can see that we have home, meals, about us, our blog, or server table and the contact. And if we move down, every one of those information came from the admin panel so that you can train those tickets in the admin panel. And those meals came from our database also and we have a menu list so that you can move from one category to another and all of this information came from our database and we have here events and news those posts came from our blog and if we move down we can see why it showed us and this also came from our admin panel or from our database and this is my name actually and let's take a look at the other pages here we can see the meals so we can open the meals page we can see some meals and they move between one meal to another using this category and we can open any meal so that we can see the meal picture, title, description, this meal for how many people, the preparation time and the price. And here we can see about us page so that we you know more information about us and this all these information came from our database, even our chef. And here, let's go to our blog. And on our blog, you can see posts, you can see beginnings, next and previous, and so on. So we can hit two to go to the two page. We can hit previous, and we can open any one of those posts. We can see the post description. We can see tags. We can see search categories and tags. All of the tags on the, our app, and we can see comments and a place to leave a comment we can move between those tags like this tags equal life and you will get only the only post with it life tag and you can choose this category and we will move to category equal to food and so on and we can also search over uh, posts like this so we'll get q equal to food and we can move down this is the post that contain food and title, description, and tags. And we also have on our blog, we can leave a comment. And we can see comments for every post like this. And we can also leave a comment. And here we also have a reserve table so that you can send a form or send information about the table you want to reserve, the name, the email, the phone, how many persons, the date, and the time, and so on. And we can also send a contact message to our Django or to our restaurant admin from this form and so on. We will start from scratch. Let's take a look at our admin panel. First of all, this is our admin panel, restaurant admin panel. We will change it or we customize this text. We will also customize the login text because we will learn how can we customize our Django admin like this restaurant admin panel. And we here have about us, we have the the Django users and groups, we have the blog, posts, categories and comments, we have the Django summer note because we will learn how can we treat with some Django package like Django bootstrap, tag it, summer note and so on. And we have in the categories meals, we have the reservation and we have the tags. And if we take a look at our meals, we can see that we have did some Django customization on our meals. So now we have the duration time and list of display, how many people, the price, we can move from one category to another using this filter we can filter by how many people who are gonna eat this meal we can search over a meal like pasta like this search so you get only one meal and so on we've also added some customization to our blog so that we can do the same things that we did with meals so we can search we can filter we can see some information from here and so on we gonna start from scratch as I said before we will learn how can we treat with models, views, forms, templates and the template filters, some Django external packages 
and how can we treat with URLs and how can we also handle forms and reviews and so on then we will move to our giant customization we will learn how can we customize the title and we will add some customization like filters, lists, play, search and so on uh, the course uh, I built this course to help you start learning Django it's understanding how you could use Django well after the course you will be able to build business websites like restaurants websites like your web personal websites websites for any kind of use and you will understand that Django well you will understand how can you customize the Django treating with models and so on see you in the course